Our second Jewish value is B'Tselem Elohim. B'Tselem Elohim is the biblical reality that each and every person you interact with is made in the image of God. In Parshat Noach that we've read today, God makes it very clear that we should live out of this truth. Do not take the lifeblood of a human being, for in the image of God, humankind was made. In Matthew 5, Yeshua draws out the heart. This is not only about murder, Yeshua says. Don't even become angry with your brother in your heart. Why? Your brother is B'Tselem Elohim, made in the image of God. A few verses later in our reading today, we read about God's covenant with us, sealed with the sign of the rainbow. A covenant is like a marriage. Two people coming together to become more than they could be on their own. Being made in the image of God means that each and every one of us is invited into a covenant with God. And more, it means that we are drawn into a covenanted life with each other. Together, we become something we could not be on our own. We need to embrace the reality that we have good godly people with different political opinions among us here at Rook Israel. And this is something we should celebrate. Further, just as we must distinguish between political and religious in the, the political and the religious in communal life, when we're interacting with individuals who are made in the image of God, we must distinguish between people and their political positions and associations. Before we interact with someone who holds a different political opinion, even one we might find offensive or abhorrent, we must first remind ourselves B'Tselem Elohim. This person is made in the image of God just as we are. Even if we feel this person is misguided in one area, this person is, in a sense, in covenant with us and has something of value to contribute 